Hi you guys and welcome back to the vlogs. I'm obviously in my kitchen. You guys, I am home for the next few weeks. I'm so happy to be home. It's kind of like the recharge that I needed. I wanted to come home and just like see Pips and see family and friends. Oh my God, wait, I can't even start this vlog without Pips. There you are. She came within like 30 seconds. <laughs> You guys the girls are back together she's like i want treats <laughs> of course the vlogs are going to continue the i'm in paris vlogs will be on pause for a few weeks until i go back anyway so it is monday and i kind of just spent the day working and playing catch up but it's around five o'clock it's kind of the end of my work day i'm kind of just wrapping up but tonight Soph and i are going to go grab some dinner and drinks together i think i need to figure out what i'm going to wear i'm currently in my work from home attire so i am gonna go figure out what to wear and i'm gonna kind of like touch up my makeup before i head out okay we're back at the outfit mirror outfit of the days um but this is what i'm wearing this jacket is from source unknown and it's this, like gorgeous suede brown dark like chocolate suede i'll have it linked if it's still available and my bag is my bottega my glasses are amazon you guys i know i'll link them as well my jeans are lioness my loafers are my little penny loafers. And yeah, that is the look. Good morning, you guys. It is the next day and I'm currently doing some laundry behind me. Don't mind my face. I just came back from my brow appointment. I'm doing all of my beauty treatments while I'm here because all of my like regular spots are obviously in Vancouver. I got my nails done. I went crazy and I got squared nails, which if you know me, you know I've had like almond nails for like five years. I've like always gotten the exact same manicure. I don't know. I went crazy and I wanted to switch it up. I also got my spray tan. I'm just really trying to have a glow up here because in France I had like no beauty appointments really like i really only got my nails done anyways we're feeling good we're feeling like we're glowing up day by day slowly but surely but today is like a home chore day i'm wearing sweatpants i'm not getting out of sweatpants today and i'm just planning on like deep cleaning the apartment and like resetting my space <laughs> I cannot believe that the holidays are right around the corner. I feel like we just blinked and already starting to think about gift ideas for the holidays. And if you're like me, I assume you're also starting your holiday shopping or at least starting to plan. So I'm so excited to be partnering with one of my favorite brands ever, Skims, to be showing you guys and introducing you to their holiday sets. So they come in these stunning, festive little gift boxes. So the first one is the Undies set, and this is the Fits Everybody Laced Dip Thong Pack. They are the iconic, like super comfortable, soft material that I have for like my everyday thongs with skims but the lace dipped ones obviously come with the little lace trimming which I think is super sexy and cute and the colors are super festive they even have the little like holiday print I just think this is like the best gift to give to your bestie especially if she doesn't own any skims yet like this is the perfect time to introduce her to the brand and then the next box is of course we cannot forget the matching little bralette and this is the fits everybody laced scoop bralette I personally love these little bralettes they are the same material soft like butter material. I honestly hate wearing bras that are uncomfortable and these are the most comfortable little bralettes. They also don't have a clasp in the back which adds to the extra comfort which I personally love. Yeah, these are the Skims holiday kits. If you guys are interested in shopping them, I'll have them linked below. And like I said, it's like the perfect gift for your bestie or even for yourself. All right, ladies, I am having a self-care night. I've been doing something every single night since I've been home in Vancouver. And tonight I was like, you know what? I canceled all my plans. I wanna just like be alone in my own bed. I'm gonna do all the skincare, all the self-care. I just took like an everything shower. This is the Tatcha water cream, by the way. It's like my favorite. But I'm just doing my skincare. And honestly, you guys, for the past few months, since I've been spending more time in Paris, my skin has broken out, honestly, pretty bad. Like I even posted about it. Cause I was like, is this normal? Like, is this what happens when you like move to a new city? I've been sick like five times this fall, as well as my skin has like kind of had some breakouts and stuff. Anyway, so many of you guys replied and said that it was very normal. And if you also moved to a new city, you said very similar things happened with you, which obviously sucks, but also gave me comfort in knowing 
that like it's not my fault but since i got home i have been on my skincare kick like i got a facial she recommended a few products that she said she thinks would help by the way this is the growth factor eye serum by so health honestly you guys my skincare is like so boring most of it's like medical grade product that i get from my facialist because like you guys know i've always had acne prone skin actually something that i've recently started trying it feels amazing on my skin hold on it's in my shower this is the zo skin health as well but it's the exfoliating polish and i've been kind of just like doing this what like once a day if that like sometimes i'll skip days just to kind of like give my skin a break but i've found that my skin is like baby smooth after i use this so so far so good and my facialist told me that this would help like unclog my pores and really keep my pores clear which i think is like the main issue with like the pollution and stuff in paris never forget lip balm my biggest pet peeve is when my lips are chapped so okay skincare is done I think I'm gonna go make myself a tea. Also, you guys, my robe, I love it so much. I got it a few months ago. It's from Iraqi and it's so beautiful and so soft. It has these like sexy little slits on the side. You guys, I have been such a tea drinker lately. I don't mean to feel like pick me, but I do think like living in Europe has turned me more onto tea. Like I've always been a coffee girl. I've always been like a hot drink girl, but tea's just like never really been something i crave i found myself a lot lately like really enjoying a nice cup of tea especially in the morning instead of coffee sometimes like i'll do like an earl gray or like english breakfast with like a dash of milk in it and like some sugar i mean but right now since i'm feeling a little bit under the weather and i'm not trying to get caffeinated i'm just doing a little bit of honey and some fresh squeezed lemon Good morning, you guys. It is the next day. I know I look crazy, but I'm just setting my hair. I just gave myself a blowout because um, I have to do some filming today. And then later tonight, I have some dinner plans. So I have to get ready a little bit earlier in the day. So I'm trying to make my hair and makeup last. Pips is also here, um, but I currently just have meetings today. And I don't know, I just like love the vibes in my room. And my vanity kind of acts as like also a desk. So I'm currently taking meetings from my vanity. And to be honest with you, it's kind of a life hack to take meetings from a vanity because you have the most immaculate lighting. So it's a vanity to do your makeup. But yeah, that's kind of my plan today. I have a ton of admin work to do. I have a lot of exciting things coming up. I feel like this is kind of relatable for like anybody in any industry, but I feel like if you're in the same career for a really long time, I've been doing this for like seven or eight years now. There's obviously gonna be like ebbs and flows in like how inspired you are, how motivated you are in your career. Obviously I've gone through those emotions as well. But all that to say is that I'm feeling very happy right now and like excited for the first time in a while. I won't tell you about all of them, but we did just place an order for the next Dirty Martini Club drop. So I'm really excited about that. And I think you guys are gonna like it. I think it's super cute. And we're actually shooting the collection in Paris. So that'll give you a little hint to the collection. We're shooting it when I go back to Paris. Um, which is only in a few weeks, which is crazy. Things are gonna be pretty busy this winter, but I'm honestly really excited. Like nothing makes me happier than just like doing the thing that I love. Like, truly nothing fills my cup more than when I get to be creative and you know, launch a project for you guys that I'm really happy about and really proud of and really excited for you guys to get your hands on. And then you guys get to enjoy it and I get to like watch you guys enjoy it. So that's the vibe for today, ladies. That became a total rant, but my call is literally in one minute, so. You can go. As needed. Okay. <laughs> All right. I want to go. We just like. I think they offer three. I think small. they offer three different sizes on the website. Yeah, it's it's fine. It's girl fine. Girl. It's girly girl vibes. All right. I just finished work for the day. And I didn't really eat today, which is awful. And I have dinner plans tonight. And since it's like 4:35, it's kind of like an awkward time. Too late in the day to have like a full meal because it's gonna spoil my dinner. But it's also like I can't wait until 8:30 when we go for dinner. I like need to eat something. So I'm currently making myself instant noodles. Basically making myself some broccoli pasta before I have to head out. I'm meeting up with Soph and another one of our girlfriends. Um, and we're trying out this new restaurant in Vancouver. So excited. I love trying new restaurants and like trying new menus, especially in Vancouver because I feel like there's not a lot of restaurants that like pop up very often here. There's also a torrential downpour out in Vancouver. So I don't know how great my outfit's gonna be tonight. 
All right, ladies, final product. Doesn't look like much, okay? I'm self-aware, it doesn't look like much. However, it's honestly one of my favorite like comfort meals. <laughs>